China, the Philippines, and Burundi voted against the move, whose backers said it was supported by more than 100 countries. Over the last year, more than 700,000 Rohingya Muslims have fled the Buddhist-majority country to neighboring Bangladesh following a military response to attacks on security posts by Rohingya insurgents. The United Nations has called Myanmar's actions ethnic cleansing, a charge Myanmar rejects, blaming Rohingya terrorists for most accounts of atrocities. China has close relations with Myanmar, and backs what Myanmar officials call a legitimate counter-insurgency operation in Rakhine. Beijing has helped to block a resolution on the crisis at the UN Security Council. Speaking to Bangladesh Foreign Minister Abul Hassan Mahmood Ali and Myanmar's Minister of the Office of the State Councillor Kai Atin Sui in New York on Thursday, China's State Councillor Wang Yi said the Rakhine issue was a complex, historical one. China hopes that Myanmar and Bangladesh can find a resolution via talks, and China is willing to continue to help provide a platform for this communication, he added. The international community, including the United Nations, can also play a constructive role on this, Wang said. The statement added that UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres is also attending the meeting, held on the sidelines of a UN summit.